Hi viewers, welcome to our YouTube channel Electrical Lectures. In this video, I will be showing you how to use 3D plotting feature of MATLAB. I will be showing you with the help of a couple of examples how to use 3D plotting feature by using different commands. So let us start. First of all, you need to define two vectors x and y depending upon the range of those vectors. Let's say the first vector is x and it is ranging from minus 3 to 3 with the increment of 0 0.1 like this and let's say the second vector is equal to x so both vectors are the same now we have to generate 2d matrices out of these two vectors by using mesh grid command let's say let's say the names of 2d matrices be x1 and y1 it is equal to mesh grid and x comma y so this is basically a 2D interpretation of the same vectors. Now we have to define the function, which function we are going to plot. Let's say we are going to plot z is equal to x square plus y square. So we will simply write here that z1 is equal to x1 square plus y1 square. I have used a dot because x1 and y1 are matrices. So this is our function. Press enter. Now we need to plot. For plotting, the best option is to use the command surf. So you will simply write surf and inside the brackets you will write x1, y1, the two independent variables and then in the at the last you will write the function which is z1 press enter and you will see this is a 3d plot now to interpret this graph you can simply see that this one is x-axis this one is y-axis and this one is your plotted function z in order to have a more smooth version of it you can use another command which is shading enter if you enter this command you can see that a plot is more smooth and in order to further analyze you can plot a color bar here to insert a color bar just go to here and this is the insert color bar so you can see these are basically the values and their corresponding colors starting from blue to yellow if the values are more higher then the color will reach to the red so now this was a very simple function now let us move to another example for a bit more complicated function let's say the function is this so to plot this function we will use the same x and y axis so we'll simply need to redefine z so i will write z1 is equal to exponent minus x1 square plus the second term which was exponent minus y1 square so this is our described function now we will use the same command of plot again which is surf x1 y1 and z1 so you can see this is another type of 3d plot and again you can smooth it and you can put a color bar like this so here it is similarly you can also use some other functions for example instead of surf you can write mesh to plot it without colors in this way so these are some commands through which you can draw 3D plots in MATLAB very easily. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned to our channel Electrical Lectures.